Hey guys, we're here at PAX West 2018 in Seattle, Washington, and BR is a big thing. Everybody's making a BR game. There's a couple of BR games here at the show, but we're standing at the Raptured Rejects booth right here, and uh, Patrick's here with me, and he's going to talk to us a little bit about the game. So what is this game, and why are you guys in the BR space? Yeah, so uh, Rapture Rejects is the Cyanide and Happiness Battle Royale that's set in a post-apocalyptic universe where God has raptured all the good people and he's left basically all the bad guys to fight it out for one last ticket to heaven. So he's kind of, God's kind of a dick and he like, this is kind of for his own entertainment. So you are one of the rejects from the from the rapture. Now, obviously, we we're just talking about this before uh, before we started the interview here. There's a lot of BR games going. PUBG, Fortnite, H1Z1's got their King of the Kill. Why are you guys getting into the BR space? Well, I think we're bringing something a little bit unique to the space. Like uh, we're from a top-down isometric perspective, it's a, a completely different feel, and we're really modeling it after MOBAs and roguelikes. Like making sure that the items that you pick up and the utilities that you um, acquire, like the skills you acquire those all interplay in really interesting ways. So like, it's not just a rifle, it's a gumball machine that shoots a, a sticky shot that slows people, and that combos really well with the toaster full of knives, which is a shotgun uh, retrofitted out of some kitchen toaster. Uh, so like, everything kind of combos together, and it's more about like, positioning and uh, combinations and just uh, like the interplay of items and how how you approach uh, combat obviously that's a little bit different than PUBG and, and Fortnite games like that what else makes it different how many players can we expect per lobby what's the how's the flow of the game work uh, currently it's 50 players for uh, per lobby they're uh, they're tighter shorter matches like we're, we're aiming for 12 to 15 minute long matches so you can get a lot more action in it's it our goal is to make it feel a little bit more arcadey uh, and like just uh, ap approachable in a way that battle royals can battle royales cannot be approachable to some people. Yeah, no hour, forty-five minute games uh, in, in this. That's really cool. There's a lot of people here hanging out at the booth. What's been the response from people that have? You guys have got probably a dozen or so laptops set up. What's the response been from people? Uh, it's it's been wonderful. Like it's really great to because this is our first show. Uh, we announced it at E3 and the response there was amazing. Uh, and the response here has been wonderful as well. Like we've learned a lot from watching people play. We have a special build where five people are playing together. It's a smaller match and it's uh, it's it draws a little bit of a crowd we like it we like seeing that oh, there's definitely a big crowd here this is one of the most packed booths in this hall that we're in here what can people do to find some more information about the game and where is it available uh, it's available on rapturerejects.com and it's also available on steam we're uh, doing pre-orders right now and you can play with us during the weekends we are continuously adding new features every week uh, and testing them out with the community and getting bug reports and feedback so well like we'd love to have more people join us uh, it's really been helpful in the whole development of the game how about a price point uh, it's twenty dollars right now and is that going to be the full price at release or is that like maybe an early access price uh, we haven't decided if that's the final price or not that's uh, just the price going forward and how about uh, Xbox and PlayStation oh we're only working on the PC version right now we haven't announced any other platforms yet awesome well Patrick from uh, Raptor Rejects thank you so much really oh, appreciate thank it you. have a good day